What's up guys, Danimal here, bringing you uh, another Star Wars diorama attempt. Uh, I recently picked up this uh, vintage collection, Ewok Assault Catapult, from a buddy of mine named Max, and uh, decided to uh, whip up a quick little mini dio for it, uh, just using some of the spare parts and little bits in here I had from um, making my Leia and Wicket diorama. So... Really, really simple, easy, easy diorama. The whole thing took me about maybe two, three hours, uh, including drying time. Uh, what I basically did was uh, I have a little wooden base platform I got from Walmart or the craft store. I'm not really sure which it was. These little bases you can get are only about a dollar, you know, 80 cents a dollar. Um, so I figured I'd utilize some of them to make uh, little mini displays uh, for some of my figs. So I'm going to be doing that in the future. Uh, but what I basically did was I took some of the uh, moss from the dollar store and ground it up pretty much into powder and then uh, put a uh, little Mod Podge down uh, onto the base after uh, painting it brown and sprinkled the uh, powdered moss over top and let that dry and then I uh, just used a stick and some of the moss I had from the craft store and once that completely dries, this will actually get solid, and uh, I think it'll look uh, pretty decent. So, just wanted to share that with you. Like I said, uh, these platforms are, are pretty cool. You know, just for another example, I quick use a little uh, metallic-looking acrylic paint, uh, silver, for the base on that one. I don't know how well it's going to show up in the lighting in here, but uh, it actually kind of matches the ship pretty well. So... That one turned out pretty decent as well, I think. And also I wanted to share with you guys a little find at the craft store. These little glue dots are pretty awesome for uh, getting your dios and displays going. If you're anything like me, I do not like display stands for my action figures. I just, I just don't like it. Just not my thing. I like it when I can get a figure to stand on its own. And as you know, sometimes that just doesn't happen very well. So these little glue dots are pretty great. Um, they definitely don't leave any sticky residue to the figure once they kind of dry on there. You can just peel them right off. So uh, they're, uh, they're pretty awesome. So I thought I'd let you guys know about that. And uh, as for the future, I'm going to uh, probably have to do a response to that action figure love uh, video, I guess, uh, since everybody else has been hitting that one up. And I figured I'd take the opportunity to show you guys my Power of the Force 2 collection, since that has a big factor in my collecting in general and you know, kind of where I started with it. So thanks for tuning in, guys. Uh, I hope to uh, catch you in the future. Please like, uh, share, and subscribe. Definitely helps out. And uh, as always, may the Schwartz be with you.